and welcome back, everybody. It is that time of the morning, afternoon, or and or evening for all of us. So how's it going? It is not a war game Wednesday on a Tuesday. So <laughs> And it will be tomorrow on my channel. <laughs> yes, it will be not a war game Wednesday. So and I like how Mike named that. It, it works out pretty well. Yep, not a yep. war game Wednesday on a Tuesday. So we love that. We're gonna run with that, I think. So yeah. Sounds official. So how's everybody doing? Are we ready to get into this? Because I have a feeling we're gonna get uh we're gonna get something handed to us on a platter. We're gonna, I, I'm got a good feeling about this, guys. <laughs> ah, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, that's that's what I say when everything's gone pear-shaped. Yeah, it's, Pete it's Tong, fine. as we stay over here. Pete Tong. Is yeah. it is it that is it that a mother's F you? It's fine. It's fine, yes, yes. Yes, and you, you and you say it very like, yes. like kind of crappy. It's fine. Yep. Whatever, yes. it's fine. It's fine. Pete, Tong. Pete Tong, it's wrong. Gone wrong. Yep. It's all gone pear shaped. So, anyways, we're gonna get into this right away. Not a much chit chatter. I've only got a couple I only got a couple hours here, so I want to get as much done as we can. So um uh, if we will direct our attention to the screen, we can go ahead and get started. So if you guys remember, last time we came out of our dungeon, we are right over here. And we are going to try to get to <laughs> the that, get all healed up. And then we're going to go after some bosses or some uh, some of these blood collectors. Yes. Which let's are a, vicious little characters. Let's do a couple of housekeeping things real quick. Okay, sounds good. I did a little investigation. Ruff, I have some good news for you. Oh. If you'll come down and look at your Viper. Hold on. You're, you're, you're familiar. Remember last time we thought you weren't going to be able to use it? Yes, that's right. I'm uh, just trying to find is, out where I am. That is not totally true. So it says each time you deal energy damage to an opponent, they suffer poison strike rank, piercing energy damage, and become drained. Right, uh, which is all good, right? And but we didn't think you did any kind of energy damage, but that's not true. You'll come up to the rule book up here, and under favorite opponents, we have each round during the declaration phase uh, choose one of the following options, and the second one down here is roll a hex die, reduce your opponent's energy equal to twice the result, and it may explode. So against a favorite opponent, if you choose this one, you can also right. your Viper. So, even though I don't use energy per se, if I get a favorite opponent, I can use that option to zap their energy. Yep. And right now, uh, yours is creatures. Your favorite opponents are creatures and undead. Yes. So, so keep that in mind, so you will be able to use that Viper. That's, oh, that's, that's that's a good that's a good do that's a good that's thing good. So. yeah because I think it oh, what am I going to do with this uh, this snake and now quickly for for Noctis this is a little confusing how he actually works and the rules it's it's really not well done you have to go online to kind of figure it out but I got it all figured out um, so basically when we choose to fight Noctis. Um, well, let me let me back up. He's got two sides to this board. That's right. This is this is the normal side, and then we have a flip side when he's fully ascended. So if at the end of like setting this up and he's at one hundred um, blood, we will flip to this side because what that means is he's going to get augmentation he has, and by getting every one of them. This is what it looks like. So what is that? Sorry to, be a, to, to black butt in there, but what does um, this uh, mean? On, oh, on uh... I'll, get, I'll, I'll get to that right now. So if we face them at 100, we're going to face them on this side, and right. all of these will be flipped to their strongest side. But if he's not at 100, we're going to use this side, and we're going to look over here. If we face him from zero up to... Um, 29 he is undead right if he is 30 or higher in blood when we face him he will be ascendant that is his type 
but it won't flip <laughs> over the um the mat. only time it gets flipped if it's uh, all the way to 100. Then when we do this, wherever we're at here, um every um uh to 10 or 20, uh every 10, every 10 ranks of blood, um, we will roll for an uh, an augmentation. So if we face him at 50, he's going to get five augmentations. Oh, crikey. Okay. These are special abilities, aren't they? Yes. And one of them, which is very interesting, is this number eight. Race Noctis's vitals equal to the amount of blood. So wherever, let's say we're facing him at 57, and one of the five is an eight, then we will add 57 to 130, what? and that's his vitals. Hence so the reason why when he's fully ascended, he's got 230. That would exactly. make sense. Exactly. Yeah. So anyway, that kind of is how that works. So um, I'll propose something that we sh that we could do. This might work out <clears throat> fairly well for us. If you guys think of something better, that's cool too. You know, we could we could go travel one to this monastery. Uh, we won't wander. We can heal completely up all the way and buy – Spend some of our goals for gear upgrades or material or you know uh, stuff, and then we could travel to this town, try to get this collector. We have to go by night. That's right. Yes. If we can get him, or when we get him, then we could, if we want, go to this red room. We have a pretty good shot at getting this investigation, and then maybe head up to this boss right here, and then that way. We can just uh, call out the uh, hellhound. You know, Sam, this doesn't sound like it's a walk in the park. It's not going to be, but we got to get No, it, it sounds like it's going to be easy. Let's just, let, yeah, we're going to go yeah, here. Okay. We're going to get, we're going to kill this thing. We're going to kill that thing. And then we're going to go kill that thing. So, it's yeah, right. it sounds great. <clears throat> right, right now, we are only knocking Noctis's blood down by eight at the end because of the monastery rooms that we turned in. Yeah, so we need to get some more. I mean, the crypt, the crypt room, well, or uh, the yeah. crypt runes. So getting some more runes would be good. We could get a red one here. If we defeat, if we defeat um, the Hellhound, we're not getting... Well, we are going to get a ruin because we're going to do this investigation. Will come off, and we'll get the benefits of the. So, uh, where's the, um, the investigation for the red for the red um, room? What's that? The investigation is right down here. What's this? The ninth one. one, right here. Right. Which means if we fail it, then we're going to have to face an encounter. But we got a pretty good chance of getting this. All we need is one yellow success. And Tony's a four. Yep. I am a four, but I also have my Hollis that I can use. So I'm actually a six for this. And then Rough Euro one. All one yeah. of us has to pass. That's all right. But don't throw we'll, don't throw over seven though. Don't throw seven or higher. Yeah. Seven plus, sorry, yes. I mean, you know, we'll take on an encounter, and we need to start taking those on, too, to start getting more goodies. So yeah. even if we fail, I think we'll be okay. We've got to look at the silver lining in every That's right. dastardly mm -hmm. encounter. That's right. right. And then, right. To, to start, yep. then, then from there, we could go up here. And if we wander and we roll up here, we'll end up on one anyway, and we call out the hellhound. Then we could make our way up to this one if we want, you know, try to get a couple of collectors down, maybe a, a boss or two here, and then we can decide where we're going from there. Yeah, sounds good. Let's uh, let's uh, let's go ahead and get started. Head yeah. to the we got to head to the um, there. We're going in my stairs, so here we we're go. Going to, to this. Tweez is in and Hissy's in, so we've got a couple of people saying hi. Hey, hey Tweez, hey, what's up, Mike? All right, so oh shoot, I hit the space bar. I hate when I what do that. Done? <laughs> All right, so we're we are cautiously moving only one. We roll our 
Uh, we roll all three, but only the yellow and blue count. Oh, because so, we can explode it if we need to. Well, you can get like a a, uh, uh, a critical success with the green and then get its benefits. So what okay. uh, part of the game turn are we on? So we are now on the skill test. Right. Yep. Skill test. Okay. Skill. Okay, we don't – okay, the water doesn't matter. I don't find any gold. Well, you know what? I could use my Hollis if I want now because I don't think I'm going to need it for anything else this turn. And I can go uh, – um, Oh, good. I don't have to eat, but I failed the other two. Oh, I'm going roll? to use my Hollis for my yellow die. R. Rough R. Yeah, it doesn't want to roll very well. Highlight them and just keep hitting R. Yeah, keep tapping R. Oh, gotcha. There we go. You and this dice in this. I, mean... I know. Crikey. Oh, what we got? No, I, I didn't two, do the blue. I have two gold. Rough, you didn't pass anything. I've got... I've oh, that's a 10, five, isn't it? Not that's zero. a 10, yeah. Mm. Correct. I didn't pass anything. Yeah, me, I have to eat. So what do I have to do? I have to eat, don't I? And what's my... Three. Three. So I've got to use three up. So we come down. Oops. Let me do that. Crikey. Everybody good? Yeah. What about I, the other? I, the only thing I failed was I failed the... Well, we didn't have to worry about the tra explore, but uh, the looking, the yellow one I failed as well. Some of my dice, I hit the R button, so it got re-rolled. But I did not have to eat. That was the one thing. Okay. So I, was, I was happy about that. So there is no circumstance yeah. because we ended up in a village. We go straight to the event. And that would be our um, monastery. So let's go ahead, and I will flip this up, and we'll do this. Okay. Skip the circumstance. The group heals all vitals and negative uh, negates any ongoing conditions or afflictions. So go ahead, everybody. Heal up completely. All vitals. Just health or... Um, health okay. and energy. All vitals. Health and energy. Right. So we're at four. Right. Okay. That's going to help out a lot. That's better. I can start sucking the life out of you guys again. Yeah, <laughs> <not> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so moving on. Uh, the items in the monastery are located. Okay, we're going to do that. Any items that have been taken? Out the way, crypts. Yep, yep, yep. And we can impart runes. We have no runes left to impart. No, we do not. So there's none of that. So we're going to flip this over, and we have one crypt key. So we can purchase up to two levels of gear upgrades and all everything up to hiking gear we can purchase. And I am definitely going to do some gear upgrades because remember, to face Noctis or these guys with Aegis, we got to get our attack oh, up. Yes. So I am going to buy a level of attack. So how okay? So how much does the gear up? So the gear upgrades heroes may now purchase the second gear upgrade slot. So yeah, so oh, that's oh, gear that, upgrade. Well, if you look at mine over here, because I'm looking at it. Yeah, I have the first one already bought, so I want to purchase the second one. It's going to cost me five gold, and then when I purchase it, my will go up by one. Okay, got it. So that that numbers the cost of that one. Yeah, so. Cost in gold. So I'm not seeing that. I see gear upgrades. Hero may now may now okay, purchase. I'm gonna come special. over to your. I'm gonna come over to your. Come over to your guy, rough. Yeah. So you see this right here. It says five. Yeah. This that's the second tier yep. of gear upgrades. So you spend five gold. Ah, oh, that's the cost. That's what I wanted to know. Increase this number by one. So do we? Uh, do my, we uh, dark, my dark legion went just went nuts because I went up to six on the dark legion. So now I can actually, I think at yeah at six the dark legion defends at half the deathly aura. 
Excellent. Remember so that. I've got, I've got the second grade upgrade and my Excellent. power goes up to eight. Yes. All right. So now this, this number is going to go up oh, by yeah. one right here. How do we do that? I think I'm Hold on. Go I, got you. I got it. I got it. I got it. It takes me a little while, but there we go. I'm going up by one. Okay. And then I'm going to, let's see. Am I going to purchase? So what else do we need? What else have I got? I've got. So you could do other of your of your upgrades, right? You can you can buy more gear upgrades if you want. You can purchase up to you know level two. So you could do those, or you can purchase stuff. Up to second, right? So. So you can get a familiar here for 12 gold. You can either gain the owl or the turtle. No, I haven't got the money for that. Crikey. Training, re training regiment. This isn't bad for you, Ruff. You may transfer any of your stat ranks to your familiars. The transfer stat must match the familiar stat rank. Only one available per hero. So whatever your... Familiar uses for his stat. You could that's um the heartbeat. That's um health. Yet yeah, you could take health away for one for one basis and Shoot. add. Oh brain. my god! Is there an undo? Mm. I yeah. just deleted everything. Yeah. Okay. Crikey, that is an undo. It's reloading. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, so um, yeah, start purchasing away. Uh, health, you know, health things would be good, right? I bought Holy three God. blessed rations, so that'll help a little bit. Yep, blessed rations will be is good for food. Mm -hmm. I bought three of those. Healing um, herbs, right? You can consume. To heal one and one, you may sacrifice a lesser potion when you continue heal, uh, consume or to instead do three. Um, holy water. Holy water you can throw on opponents and you don't have to worry about ages. Uh, the elder bear. Oh, swift foot el 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 elixirs wouldn't be bad. That'll increase our time in the dungeon. No, so, do you, if you guys think we're going back in the dungeon, I don't think anytime real soon. We've, we've got plenty to do on the surface, haven't we? Tra Traveler's kit will heal one health or one energy at the beginning of movement phase. Elderberries will give you two health, two energy. No, I think I've only got six gold left. I want to. Uh, hmm. Hiking gear will reduce energy drain for reckless movement by one, and vitals healed from camp <clears throat> increase vitals by one. Hiking gear, that's not bad. And it's only one per group, too, so that just takes care of the whole group. No, it's one per hero. No, uh, only one available per group. Oh, got it. Yeah. So each hero has to spend four if we want to get it. Oh, blimey. That's... Um, hmm. Which we don't have to, right? We can get... I would probably get some elderberries. That's what I was going to finish off my gold with the elderberries. I what can get two going? elderberries. And that'll take care of my gold. I'm going to get some holy water as well. Traveler's kit is four. All right, let me see if I can go up on any of my stats. That would be helpful. So five for nourish. Oh, up. Oh. Four for nine points. 
As he says, too much talking. Start fighting things. We'll get there. We had to heal up first. We just got out of the freaking dungeon. Jeez. Shush, hissy. Uh, yep. Now, my yellow one down the bottom there is at one, yeah? Yes. But yes. I've got an upgrade. Then you need you to go up one on that. You could You could go. No. No, no. You, you already... You've already got that up there. You were at zero. That was one of your right touch. Yeah. Okay. You oh, but then it start at one, though. It looks like it should have started at oh, one. One of this, this one right here made it go down by one. Oh, okay. Got it. Got it. I'm glad somebody remembers. Yep. So for you, though, you could spend four and have it go up to two if you wanted. Survi um, one of these is really important if we die. I think yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna upgrade this for. Oh no, four. That, that'll, that'll skint me out. So uh, there we go. One, two, three, four, and that goes up to two now. Yeah. Yes. That's me. I'm skint. I'm done too. I'm gonna go. Look at, uh, you know, the millionaire Mike there. 18 gold. I had 19, and I I upgraded two of my things. So. <laughs> right. How much are the other elderberries? They are two. Uh, three. No, three. Three. three oh, three. shit. Oh, sorry. Excuse me. I've been demonetized. Three. It, um, three. I think I've overspent there. I can't afford them. Let me give back two. One, two. And. Take those off. And I thought they were one each. They're not. They're three, aren't they? Ooh, crikey. Uh... Okay. Healing herbs. Hold on. Just going to get a couple of – I'm going to spend – get a couple more healing herbs. Well, the other thing that we could – you know, you guys might want to consider, it will waste time, but if we do camp, you should be able to take off a critical hit. You guys, critical hits are getting pretty close. They're getting a bit nasty, aren't they? They're uh, getting up there. But I'll so, knock us and keep an eye on us when we it, camp, honey. And then, so this, um, they are a plus two because we. Or was it plus one because we went cautious? Uh, cautious plus one. Apparently, cat uh, hissy cat is fisty today. I guess so. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's not feisty. He's fifty. Fisty. Yeah. And toys wants uh, his money back. And you can get every cent of that there. Because <laughs> yep. he's because he's ordered this as well. Three. Five, six, seven. We are going up seven blood. Bloody hell, oh, we have yep. to. Got to sort that out. Don't like that. Did you already do the blood pool? I did not. Okay. I'm doing the line right now. You do the blood pool. Uh, that puts us at 42. That's not great. No, but we get a plus one, yeah? Well, we get a that's bad too. Yeah, we yeah. get one on our roll. Here we go. Here's the roll. Plus one. Ten. God, dog, yeah. another collector. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, Crikey. We went by night because it's on night. Um, plus one to the die roll, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Give me plus one. Oh no, six. Wow. There goes well, that. There goes that. That, that goes that. that, that oh no. Oh no. That town's oh, yep. gone. Yep, that town right here is gone. All right, I'm going to find the town things. Where are the town? Oh, up here? Are they up here? Uh, I want to say yes, but they're not. 
Oh, is this it right here? Is this red one here? It looks oh, like yeah, a red yeah, that's it. Uh, why are there no more than those? Oh, I'm gonna copy. We, we only paste. want one. And paste. Want to pick that die up for me? Yep. No, not really, but. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. And that's too big, so let's go small. You can drop it back on there. All right, lost that town. Rats. But on the plus side, at least it didn't add to their collection. That's true. No, no, right. <laughs> we can't, a, we can't go deal with side. it now. No, we can go deal with it. We just don't get it as the village ex experience. That's all. all right, oh, we so can still can, oh, we can still go after the blood collectors, even though it's devastated. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ah, to strike. Good, good. Okay, so let's go ahead and why don't we move one, two, three, four yep. to this collector? Uh, are we at night then? Yeah, yeah let's, let's yeah. go at night because we might have to wander and if, then we can maybe get um, some experience. Um, no, yeah, night. Maybe we can get some experience for this one because we want to try to. Uh, to do this next. So, all right, here we go. We move four. Okay. Moving That's four. Normal movement. Is normal movement. Is normal movement. Yeah. So we roll all three, and there's no adjustment on the on the blood pool die. Okay, everybody roll. Oh, I exploded. Well, good. On which one? Ah, uh, the yellow one. All right. Well, that's good. I Bring passed it, all three, it, so we're not, we're not going to wander. Okay, good. I'm oh. going to get two gold because I passed my yellow. All right. Oh, and each, yeah, so critical success on your Explore Hill go gains you two gold and choose one. Each hero gains one health, or you may place a cube on an open investigation of your choice. Awesome. So what do you so think? So I get two gold, and then... Which one are we going towards anyways, by the way? Well, this is the red rune right here. Okay. And so what gonna... that will give us is, if we do roll the trap, the monster will do one less damage. Okay, well, um, since that's where we're headed, I think... You want to do that one? Yeah. All right, let's do hey, that can one. You, um, can you uh, king me so I can clone stuff just in case? I sure can. I failed here. everything, so I've just had to eat. I do have to eat uh, well, four food. Promote you too, so you can copy and paste. All right. All right. So I've been, been kinged, knighted. Okay. Okay. So we are in this village. Because we ended up in a village, we do not have to do the circumstance again. And we go straight to the event. Uh, sell runes, purchase items, or face Noctis collectors here. Well, yes. time to face Noctis collectors. Yeah. All right. So, well, you know, is there anything that we want to do in the city beforehand? Um, I, I have only two gold. There's not much I think we can do. Yeah, the group. No, uh, I have none. Equipment, you know, the group may pay one gold, stay in the inn, heal, pay none of that. Runes may be sold for 10 gold, none of that. So we're going to go after a collector here. All right, here we go. So coming over to the collector's board. Okay, we're getting into it now, guys. Those of you that were complaining, we're getting yeah, into it. Yeah, you whiners out there. Yeah. All right, so um, desolated villages. We don't have to worry about that right now. Facing collectors. Night, during the event phase, you may roll Explore to attempt to find a collector in the village. If at least half the group succeeds. Face, face each collector in combat in one battle. Benny Hill critically succeeds. You ambush each opponent. Roll a three-sided die for each to determine the type that we're facing. If you flee, all collectors return to the location, even if you defeat them. 
right? So we got to roll and explore. That's the yellow die, Just isn't it? Our yellow die. And this is not an investigation. So no, I failed. Oh, let me get mine. Oh, 10. And that's a critical fail, isn't it? So, yeah, but it's not going to hurt anything. Right. So, okay. I got to I got to pass this in other words. Yep. Come on, you can do it, Mike. No problem. No. Nope. You know. No luck. All right, we okay. couldn't find we couldn't find them. They ran away from us. They're scared of us. Yeah, they did. Well, that's unfortunate because now we got to do another villain phase. Seven more, seven more blood. <laughs> Forty-nine. So yeah, it's yep, a bit early. People, people are still working. What? He's got to get back to work. He's on the West Coast too, so. Forty-nine. Oh, this is going fast, boys. We're halfway there. Yeah, we got to get rid of these collectors. Okay, well, um, now we have to roll the die, and we went normal, so just a regular die roll. Six. Six. Two penalty to start tests. Next Stop tests. Okay. Next so game. do this. This is a um, – I'm going to give everybody a – a white die and put it on your skills here to remind you that you have to add two to uh, it. Two to it. Copy. To, to every skill test. Yep, to your, to your skill tests. I'm going to do those then, am I? <laughs> well, you have to do that. I, well, I know, but I'm not going to pass them. There you go. There's a two for you. And you Thank just you. put that here on your skills to remind you. Okay, so that's that. So that's for next turn. So we are off to the next turn. Can we stay here and try again? We can. We can camp, and you know what? That'll get rid of a critical hit for you. Yeah, let's. Well, let's do that. So we can camp. Yep. We'll camp do not instead, each hero heals three health and three energy, and what and one critical wound. Well, it's only one critical wound, so we can get rid of that nonsense. You can get rid of one of those black cubes. Uh, navigate automatically succeeds. Gain a minus one to your skills rolls this turn. Oh, so that comes down to one then? Yeah, it'll come down to one. How do we do that? You may discard a circumstance you roll this turn. Well, there'll be no circumstances because we're, we're in a village. So... I'm going to put mine down to one. There we go. Ooh. I figured it out. I figured it out. Yep. <sighs> okay, so well. so this is a cumulative. So I'm going to put this purple cube at one to remind us that we spent one turn camping. Okay. So if we fail again, next time we'll get a plus two to a skill roll. So, okay, everybody roll your skills and, uh, and add one to them. No, I... I failed everything except for food. So, well, excellent. I failed everything. Uh, oh no, everything. So I've got to. Oh crikey! Well, well that it. ten, that ten just that zero just throws you off, Ralph. All the time. I know. I, keep <laughs> I, I know it's the same zero. thing for me too. Yeah, it's the same thing for me too. So I can't. I can't. Uh, forage and i didn't find anything is that about right then that is correct if nothing yep. else happens what's the uh let me get the, gotta eat. you gotta eat i've done that i've knocked me uh okay down and that's it because that's it for skills we are off to um event because we, we skip circumstances we're in a village yeah, so yep. circumstances don't happen in certain parts, village being one of them, right? Yeah, so this is bad because uh, this is a skill test. 
this is a this is a this is a stat test. I'm sorry. So um, what's Excellent. the difference between a stat, stat we, test and a skill test? We have we have to add one to this yellow die to try to find them again. Nope. All right. Okay. Let me move down. No. I hate these dice. <laughs> All right. So I got to roll a three. Come on. Three. Oh. Eight. Knock this turn. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Did you roll a three? No, I hit the button. No. Oh, this is, this is bad. We're wasting time here. Seven more. Yeah, we're gonna run out of time. We may we may want to skip going after this collector. Yep, I agree with you on that Fair one. Fair enough. It was worth a, a second go, but the way the dice are rolling, no. I don't know. I mean, we're up to almost sixty already. This is not good. But then, if it was easy, it wouldn't be fun. Would it? That's right. What do you suggest, Mike? After the gem, after the sorry rune. Thinking here, thinking. Mind you, a red one is a bad one, isn't it? Could we? Oh no, we've got an investigation for it, haven't we? Yeah, we have to invest. Why don't we? We could just go straight for a boss. Oh, well, there's one right. Now. We could do that one, or we could, if we come up and do this one, if we miss on our navigation. Oh, we might yeah. wander into this one. That's true. And That's these true. are random bosses, aren't they? No, we. This is this is not a random. We call the boss that we want, but then we have to roll. Oh, and then see if it right. Change. Yes. Right. One, two, three. Move normal. Yep. And we All don't right. have to add stuff anymore. So go ahead and roll your skit. Yeah, we don't have any. Issues with our so get rid of these. I'm gonna pull these dice up here so you don't right do okay. that again. and we'll roll all three. Oh, I don't have to eat. I've been doing good with that. I think I will do oh blue. The, the blue lands grants one additional clue for a circumstance. Uh skills made minus two to skill rolls made during skill phase. The green lens gives the wielder a minus two bonus to skill rolls made during skill phase. We're not doing an investigation. I'm going to use. Didn't, uh, I didn't get my navigate. The other, the other ones are sorted. I'm going to use my green to go minus two on my skills. Oh, you got it. <laughs> Naturally, I too. Have Actually, I have two because minus two that brings this down to a one, which is a hex. Oh, okay, that brings that down to there, and that brings that down to there. So you've passed them all. I know I passed them all, but I also passed two. Which come over here, check this out. When you pass two of them, in addition to the normal bonuses rolled. On the moon die, roll a moon die, the group gains a random rune. You may only gain this up to once per game turn. So roll a moon die, a white die. Got it. 11. 11 gives us a blue rune. Got it. So I'm going to put this down on the blue rune and go up by one. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, we got that. So you don't need you, you don't you can don't leave need, it there if you want just to remind us. So you yep. don't need the rune, you just make a note of it. Right, gotcha. Yeah, so, gotcha. All right. Well that's good because we're better we, than a poke in the eye. If we can turn some more another set of those in, that'd help us out with uh blood at the end. Yep. For sure. Okay, well, you hex the uh, the explorer and the knight uh, navigate. So, oh, I yep. think Tweezer's gone as well. He's off to rehearsal. Yep, yep. 
we also yes, get, we also get the yellow. So go ahead and put another clue on that yellow, Tony. Okay. And we will. Um, we also get the green. What is green? We get to put a clue also somewhere. You want to put a, a, another one there? Yeah, might as well finish it off. All right. And I get two gold. Excellent. All right, guys. Well, we are, we do have to do, wait, we're in a boss location. Is yep. that a, do we skip the skill on a boss? I don't think, yeah. So ha, ha, this, uh, yep, we're looking at. Yeah, we skip the circumstance and go to the event. Ah, uh, we skip it, right, okay. All right, here we go. Are we going to go after the, uh, come up to the top left corner? We're going to go after the hellhound, right? So we get yeah, a key. Yeah, we'll start off with that one, yeah. That's a level one, so yeah. Okay, so we need a roll moon die. Oh, uh, Okay. Let's see here. Nine. Oh, we All get right. the hellhound. We get the hellhound. Yeah, I was going to say, let's over bring here. this out. Come over are here, these, hellhound. Are these, um, these only used once and are removed yep. from the game? Yeah? Yep. Right. Yep. All right. So let's go over this whole thing hard for you so you can see. So you can see up here, we need Aegis of One to be able to attack this guy right off the bat. And we all have that one ear, one gear upgrade on our attack. Yep. So we can immediately start doing health damage. If we didn't, we would have to get his energy down to zero. Then we could attack his health. So we're good to go after his health right off the bat. Right. He is an ascendant, so that is where none of us get any, you know, a uh, favorite opponent there. Okay. He's got 22 health and 20 energy. You want to put that on our board? Yep, I will. So the group reward for this, we get another key, which will allow us to do more gear upgrades, which is really good. We'll each get two power-up cards. We'll each get eight gold and three food, and then single rewards. One of us will get plus three to their health. The other person will get a hellhound familiar. That is what we're looking at. Now down to the bottom. The very bottom one says difficult uh, plus, which means if we were on a difficult uh, level, this bottom one would, would be in play, but it's not. We are on easy or normal or whatever we are. He does have an infernal flame. Heroes deal one less damage and defend as if they were, their rank was one lower for each instance of burn they have. So every time we get a burn, we'll keep a running track as a staff. We'll have to subtract one from our um damage and our defense right okay now the other thing is this is the stuff that he will do we'll roll a six-sided die when it's his turn and he can do dual health and survival that means you don't do your survival you're burned he can defend and burn heroes suffer two damage this round he can um Three health and explore. Burn uh, energy, navigate. Uh, yeah, there's a bunch of, you know, it's four, three, four damage and burn. And remember, his burn is going to do less damage to us because we have these. This investigation now is we are basically doing this thing. He's okay. Not where he's supposed to be. So we get the benefits of this because we are facing the Hellhound, and we have done this much investigation on the Hellhound. But we thought he was going to be here, but he's not. He's actually where we are right now. So if we defeat him, we're going to get this green room. Yeah, I was going to ask you about that, by the way. So, that, so that, even though we're not on the right uh, hex tile. 
because we're confronting him now, yep. that, that applies. Yes. Ah, right. All right, so we have to decide what are we doing. Oh, yeah. Uh, let's see here. Um, let's see here. What am I going to do? He's got 22 uh, health. How much damage can you do, Tony? You well, are wrong. Um, I'm going to see here. Yeah, well, okay, so I can do three. Let's see. So that is my health tap. Uh, so my health tap, eh, I can siphon up to six from each of you. Oh, guess what? I also failed a, a stat test during the event phase twice. So I have two levels of this one. When we, we, we were in town trying to get the oh, one. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. And then heal a group. Haven't done any healing. So, okay. I am good on my on my traits. Okay. So, I can do... <laughs> I can do... If I take six from each of you, I can do 18 damage. Oh, excellent. Do it. So... Um, uh, and I just want to... So, I can do... my Yeah, my siphon is three times two. So, that's six. Um, so I can go, what, what kind of damage can your dark legion do? Well, that's what I was going to, that's what I was going to look at. So my scarecrow, um, can do eight. here also. What? You have some bonuses here for them too, right? Okay. E yes. So yeah, add, add, add three, add three to what they're doing. Each can gain their Dan. Um, each can. They each can use attack and gain a damage boost equal to the number of encounters in the Dark Legion. So there's only two encounters plus, in there. Oh, plus, one plus. plus. Plus one. Okay, so this is actually three then. Yeah, well, that, that's what that says. Look. Yep, so I got says, it. I see it. Yep, one plus the encounter. Yep. So you are three. So, so that would be 11. 11. And six, you could do 17 without draining anything from us. Well, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do my Dark Legion. Okay. So, oh, and by the way, it is, I am up to six on that. So at rank six, the Dark Legion defends at equal to half the Deathly Aura rank. So they can help defend too. I think you should be doing, no, I don't see it anywhere. You might want to like make a note on your on your on your maybe this about that. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh, I, I got it. It's it's on there, so it's it's pretty easy to remember. So I got you. So, I got that. Okay, so go ahead and write the damage that you're doing on the board. Okay. So you too, what are you doing, Ruff? I'm just checking. What's the um uh the little uh doo -doo -doo -doo. Lightning bolt. It's this one here, isn't it? This it's one. It's not your top one. So you can, this measure deals health damage equal to aggressive stance, six, rank plus yeah. brutal assault, which is this one. So you're up to 14 damage. This damage is difficult to defend against. If your opponent defends, roll a 10 sided die. If the result, result is less than or equal to your aggressive stance, this attack deals piercing damage. At right, right, this, this eight plus three, is that why I'm doing with this aggressive stance? That stance. Got me talking American now. Yeah, <laughs> yes. You should be. So stance. You, this should be, instead of a three, that should be a six. Ah. Oh. Why? Because of the because lightning bolt. Because right. this is six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can do that, and you can um, do 14 damage. It'll cost you one energy to cast this. So go down an energy. Mm -hmm. Yep, go down oh. an energy. Put 14 for a rough attack. Okay. And... If if remember if he defends, then you're going to roll a die, and it could become piercing damage. 
Okay. Right, for me, I think I will do a nourish. I think I will do a nourish. This will this will heal. Or should I just block his damage? Just block his damage. I can go one, two, three, and I will do a a sacred protection. Block judgment rank. So I'm blocking nine divided between two characters. All right, so that's what I'm doing. So I am blocking. I'm going to go here. I'm blocking. I'm going to put it down here. Nine. All right, so let's see what he does. I need one of these crazy little dice here. Yeah, yeah. I still haven't got my head around the combat, but yeah. One. He's going to do a one. So he's going to duel, which means two of us are going to take two health and a survival. Those who fail survival become burned. So the two health are going to be blocked because I did a block. Mm -hmm. So we don't have to worry about that. And I don't, I think. Burn only lasts until let's look, let's read up burn real quick. Burned targets lose three health at the beginning of the declaration phase of each round and heal three less health each time their health is healed. So I still can block everything that he did. And we're gonna we, we had, we're not going to get to a declaration phase because we're going to kill it. Yeah, yeah. yeah so, we have uh, we have thirty one hit, and he has twenty two health. Just so, remind yeah. me again, we threw a one. What's the little red hexagon with the cross swords mean? That means he's doing his attack. Do we have to defend normally? We'll... No, no, no. He's doing an attack. He's doing an attack, and he's going to do dual, which means two of us have to take two health and a survival roll. Right, so that being there doesn't really mean anything to us. No, it does right here. So look at the fl uh, fire breath. Right. He doesn't have enough energy to do it. He'll do his attack at half strength instead. He'll come up one, won't he? you come up no, to the, the one above. No, no, he'll do his attack. The red, he'll do this one. The red means attack. The yellow, orange means defend. If you look, it's right. The words are oh, right next sorry. to it. I remember reading. It says if you haven't got enough energy, it comes up one level, but it means that of that red one. Yeah. So yes. and then like this one is would be yes. this one here. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Right. Gotcha. Gotcha. All right, it so tells we, you what we, to do. It tells we, you which one to go to on there. We wiped him out, and the burn does not take a. It, it's not a persistent thing, so it immediately goes away after combat. So we did everything we needed to do there. I didn't heal anybody. I blocked. So because um, one tar becomes blessed until the end of combat, blessed raise one plus sacrifice health, but it didn't happen because no one took any damage. So that's it. We defeated him with one one round. He's only a level one. We should be able to kick oh, their I get to move up on something. I get to move up on something here because I have I finished with full health. Yeah, that's right. So, um, let's How see. About you, Ruff? What's yours? What's my what? End game turn with three or less health. Uh, never mind. Your your trait. Um, right here. No, let me read this again. Hold on. Keep forgetting about that. End game with three. No. Well, those two at the bottom. Those two little things at the bottom don't apply. No. Well, the first one does. Heroes deal one less damage, but we're, none of us were burned. The bottom one does not apply because we're not on difficult or higher level. Right. Gotcha. Okay. So that took care of that. So let's give get our stuff. We get a one key. Why does this keep resetting? What? This battle map keeps going to zero. Oh, I I don't know why the keys are, but I did the bottom ones. This got reset for some Oh, because maybe because I did a. 
And this got reset. I don't understand why. This got reset. Hmm. That got reset. This got oh, crazy. I don't know why. All right. So there. Now we have two keys, which is excellent. And this got reset. We can buy up to two of those. We're a two tier for our blood magic. We have one of those. All right. We're all good there. All right, guys. Here we go. Let's continue with our goodies. Everybody get eight gold and three food. Eight gold. Oops. I can't find that thing now where and how much gold did I say? Eight. Eight gold. Eight gold. Excellent. All right. Now now for the good stuff. Here you go, Tony. <clears throat> I'm still trying to find that. Oh, end combat with full health. Yeah. What is so? Does that mean I get? I do that one. You get you get a check. Okay. Okay. Now now you're full. Okay. So you erase them. Okay. And, and go up one here. And now, no, no, don't go on the top. Okay. Oh, okay. So if one rank, and now this applies. Equal to twice the headstrong rank while you are at or above full health. Oh, okay. So I yeah. automatically, my strength is one, so I automatically deal two damage in addition to what I deal. Interesting. Sweet. All right. Okay. So everybody has two power-ups. Go ahead and, and get your power-ups. Oh, three more health. That is amazing. Not just killed hundreds. They have simply vanished. He must be brought to justice. Yes, he must. One or plus three. I really like the plus three. I'm taking the plus three. Uh, oh, plus two, explore. This group also gains one blood magic tier. Oh, all right. I'll give us a blood magic tier. So the, our tier now is three. I'm going to draw us another card. Hold on. That's plus excellent. Two, explore. That's better. So here is our card. So far, left one will uh, bone reading. We'll we'll read up on that in a minute. All right, let's do the next one. And don't forget if there's any uh, adjustments to the blood blood pool. Uh, the I have a minus one die roll for us. Oh, I've got a it, it, so I've got the explore with plus two. That means it goes up two. Yeah. Yep. Nothing else on there. Just that blood magic. Yep. Right. Blood magic. So you're four, you're, you're I've two. Done it, I've done that, yeah, yeah. Excellent. Uh, and. Oh, both masteries. Hello. Hello. Okay. Navigate and defend go up one. Navigate. So they and both go up two. And. It is dangerous traveling beyond the village. You best be careful. Yeah. Okay, so who's going to take the... I fear cannot be served with might alone. We need eldritch magic to face the coming darkness. So I've got two things here that can go up two. Is that right? Yep. And not an ore. Uh, and uh, this one. Hold on. And we get another... We get a... What was it? Put that up to and a plus one to and this. Plus one. Oh yeah. Plus one to zero. Well, your we, aggressive we, stance just went insane. By the way, you're now eight plus eight. <laughs> so oh, yeah, you're up. To, that. You're up to sixteen. I like. I like it. And I think you're. Um, 
No, not quite yet. Oh, no, this will be one. Your number of strike for your relentless strike will now be two because uh, it's four divided by three is one plus one. So that's two. Yep. Oh, blimey. Right. And one of us gets a pup familiar and one of us gets a plus three to their health. Um, can I take the plus three to my health? I'm only at um, nine. Yes. And let's take a look at this pup and see what he does. Do I, and I regen, I go all the way up to where I went, correct? So I add the health too as well. You you add both, both numbers, the add them all. Okay. Each time you gain a condition in combat, your opponent becomes burned. Mm. Instead of normal burn damage, the damage suffered is equal to this guy's rank, this stats with itself at rank eight once per turn. You may spend two energy to activate this temper without gaining a condition. So who wants this head, this guy? Well, I've got one already. Tell me, do you want it? Or do you want me to take it? Go ahead. Go ahead. You go ahead and take it. Okay. So if I take this dude, he will... Start at what's it say? It says one plus one third matching rank, and I can choose either mastery, so it doesn't really matter which one I choose. I will choose the uh, I'll choose the bottom one, so he's going to start out at two. So I'm going to take this die. What is going on with my computer? <laughs> Jumping all around. Damn, Windows computers. It's going to start at rank two. And I need a little cube. Pick a black one. And I have to put it on the bottom one because that's the one I chose. There we go. So right. rank Limey. All right. So that one is everything has been given out. So the dark, dark fay, we could definitely use, you know, we might end up having to go against this one, so I'll put it back. And we also get something else, boys. We also get this. Give us a green rune. Yep, we'll do that. Oh. We got a green rune. This goes away. And draw another. Yeah. And this comes out. Oh, on B, a red rune on B, Tony. Down here in the far bottom corner, right in the middle. This is the endless depths. The walls of the chasm are coated with a fine, sticky substance. It causes you to experience maddening and reckless thoughts. So there is a red rune right here, and it is a all skills. We have to... We have to pass all three of our skills. All right. The two gives us a minus one. The trap is a six plus, and we would lose three health. But scrape it off, uh, scrape it off, and you have the remnants of a powerful elixir. Upon completion, each hero rolls a moon die. Those who roll a four or less gain one sovereign elixir. If at least one hero rolls a four or less, the group also gains one awakening brew. Okay, so there's some stuff that we can take off the walls. Lovely. We also get a minus one. We get a minus three. Is that or they well, we don't do with it? Are they those um, clues? Yeah, those, are, they, those are not on there. No, right. Well, that was too good to be true. But they were on there for they were on there for the other one. Yeah. yeah. All right, so that's where we are. So that one's right here. Yep. 
close to us. All right, so... so we, and we need a red rune to get uh, a set. Excellent. We can come down here and do this one easily. Yep. Which we could do now. So, okay, let's continue on. That was the um, event phase. Yep. Now Noctis has to go. Oh. Thank damn it. So another seven? Another seven. Good grief. Now, which one takes the blood away? Is that the crypt? That takes it away immediately? Yes. Or is it no, that the monastery takes it in the way immediately. The crypt takes it away at the end of the when we face them. So we might want to head to the monastery to get rid of. I don't, I don't know. I'm wondering. Do we do we want to make him less powerful at the end? Because if we if we turn in another full set, yeah, we're gonna get three power up cards plus. We'll go another one up here. So one, the group will also gain uh, one that's twice. Okay. Effective. And now it'll be two, four. Oh, I'm sorry. Take that back. It'll be 12 plus 10. Well, we'll come down 22. Okay. Well, that Let's does, do yeah. I guess, I guess that makes sense. Yeah, because this is, I mean, we're kind of late in the game to get these graces to help us. Yeah, but to get the... Problem here is, right, the first time we we, we do a full set, it doesn't do anything. we got to do another full set to get five. Oh, okay. So and really then another doesn't... full set to get five. And okay. So, yeah, I think so, yeah the crypt's have... really the way to go. I think so, this late in the game. We gotta affect his final. Yep. And what did we get here? What did we get here? Plus two health and one crit. Looking at the number of cards at the top of any one deck, equal to your tier. Place any of those cards at the bottom of the deck and return the rest. Okay, so we can adjust our deck that we want. You know, which could be helpful if we want to. You know. Look through the any any deck. Look at yeah, the deck. number yeah. of cards at the top. Any one deck. Oh, we could do like the the rewards deck to really stack what we might want, or the or the you know event. In interesting. All right. Time, time for Noctis. Yep, so he's got to go up seven. Again. Oh, I got him up seven. So 63. 63. And we're rolling on a zero. Yep. Five. Okay. No more collectors, at least. Yeah, one piercing health damage. So everybody takes one health damage. Uh, da, 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 da. All right, new turn. What do we want to do? Well, let's go after the rune so we can get a set. So, is we so this one's right here. Okay. Um, we'd have to go during that day. No, that's night. So we're going during the night. Okay, we're going to go one, two at night. So that is normal movement. So that mm -hmm. is a, that's a nothing on the blood, on the blood deal, normal. Yep, and we're rolling all three. And this is an investigation. I'm not going to use my Hollis for this. Yes, I, ex I exploded. On the uh, um, navigation, so we're not we're not going to be wandering. Excellent. I did fail my food and my explore, but that's oh, okay. I, got, I got my explore. Oh, I got two little hexes. What does that mean? Oh, that's awesome. Oh, oh my god, that's, oh, that's awesome. Cool. Okay, so let's let's take this. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and do mine real quick. I got two gold and a yellow, which gives us what does yellow give us? 
Uh, you get a we get a clue. Same thing with the green or, or a health. Each hero heals one or place a clue. Do we want a Do we want a clue on this? We've already got three clues on there. Oh, okay. Well, we can put a clue somewhere else if we want. We're we gonna go after this. We're going after this red one right now. Yep. Which is yeah. We have three on it already. Yep. Uh, is there anything up here that we want to go after? Uh, is there anything else over here? So we just got this one. Uh, we don't have M. We have M is out. It's a long ways away. Yep. Right? Yeah. M's oh, like, hold on. Out at, uh, no, M's not out. M's not even out. Oh, okay. What about the dark bay here? Does this one out? Yeah, you come up here and look. We can go as a random boss on him. Dark Fay is only a level one. We'll wipe him out immediately. We could get a couple of. We could, let's see what 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 can we get? He's got an outlast of two plus one per hero of five. So, so reduce so Dark Fay's by the number of cubes. I mean, uh, it's, not a, it's not a great one to go for. It does give us the dragon. You know, I think we could mess around with maybe the Mad Alchemist. The Mad Alchemist is 45. But he's got another key. We need another key to face Noctis. We get a familiar, three to explore, two cards, 15 gold. Well, we're worried about the clues right now. We can't because we got oh, yes, we the Diary of the Mad Alchemist. A legendary Hold on, do you want me to do my dice or not? Yeah, 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 the, yeah let's do your dice. So I've got two um, critical successes so on the yellow. The, so for the yellow, you can we can put a clue. Yeah, or we can heal a health, or you can open. Uh, uh, yes, that's right. Yeah, two, duh, 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 duh. and then we're going to roll a moon die and get a, a free room. Where does it say that? If that one says it on, if you roll down here, if you roll two or three. Oh, right, it's on something else. I've got two. Right, sorry, I'm looking, not looking at the oh, multiple critical successes, two or three in addition. Now, roll the moon die. So. And now you can do this for your blue. Let me get. Uh, let me get. Hold on. Let me get. Let me do my gold first. Two gold. And. Oh, to succeed, you may do. Still, you're getting a, uh, are you going to place? Are you going to place a clue with that yellow die? That's what we're trying. We're going to end up being able to place three clues. Right. Okay. Uh, so, no, not on the blue one. The blue one, you can. You can. Take off one person can take a critical hit off. Yeah, that's what I might do. Go ahead, do your blue one, take uh, one of your criticals off. And then uh, your yellows can either be I have a yellow, you have a yellow. I have a green, which is kind of the same thing with the clue. Okay, so there's three clues. Why don't we yeah. put three out? I mean, yeah. one health is not that big of a deal, except for you, Tony, right? What if you start? Isn't one of your things if you start healthy? Yeah, if I start, it's this thing right here. This okay, so why don't we do why don't we take your green and okay? Wait a second. Yeah, there's there's honestly not a whole lot of clues, a lot of stuff that's like clue wise that we're really gonna need too much of. So I'll take the one to heal no, myself. I'll, listen, listen, I'm gonna use my yellow because it has to be yellow. Okay. Each hero heals one. For my yellow, everybody heal one one health. Okay. So I'll, right. get you, I'll get you up, Tony. Gotcha. Now, for your two guys, why don't we put uh, clues out? Okay, so we got two clues. Where's D at? Which investigation do we want to go after? Well, you know, this red one's really close. Why don't we go after this red one right here? 
Why don't we put two clues on this one? The uh, the that okay, one. that's fine. That's good. Yep. All right, we're good. Okay. Now, roll, or I'll roll the die. Let's roll the moon die, yeah. There's our free room. It's an 11. Well, that's uh, blue. That's a blue. Oh, yes. This is really going to help us. Okay, so we did our skill. We got our skill test. So now we circumstance. Yep, now this is a circumstance. All right, so we want to go ahead and roll one die and we went by well we went by night. So yep. we'll just do, we'll just do night. Um Yeah, yeah cuz we're, we're right here, we had to go by night. Well, no, we didn't have to. We could have went by day, but that's okay. Okay, so what do we do for this one? Oh, we're just gonna roll a um, we're gonna roll a six sided die right here. I'll roll it, and we got a hex, so we're gonna have to do an encounter. So here we go, more 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 stuff for your dark your uh, legion, Tony. And wait, wait, is it a ten? Wait, I don't think it's a six sider because uh, it's it got is. a ten plus. Can you guys have to do it, Tony? We're rolling this one, two, three, four, five, or six. It's this number up here. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. And we already six, so we get this encounter right here. I'll pull it down here by our board. Oh, oh, what is this? Darkness closes in. Draw an encounter for each slot on the day and night bars and place each encounter face down on top of the slot. The next time you play the slot, you must face the encounter first, even if you moved cautiously. Oh, okay. Ooh, okay. Excellent. So each one of these gets an encounter. On the, on the day and night? Day and night. Yep. Darkness is closing in. And we ended, we ended at um, this one right. No, not that one. We ended here. Yep. So we're gonna have to face this encounter. Okay. Oh. We're ready for it. Do you was? Yeah. Let's bring it over here. Oh, oh cracky! Right. All right. A night stalker. It's only a little eleven. This guy's gonna die immediately. Okay, I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do healing because I want to get my other thing up a little bit. So we're going to do. I'm gonna do heal. That is going to cost me three energy. Yeah, energy is going down. You know what? I'm going to take. Two and one. And I'm going to heal. Oh, what are you going to end up doing, Ruff? What do you think you're going to oh, do? 16, 16, 16 piercing damage. Well, it's only eleven. You can do you can do just the judgment, which is nine. Yeah, and that won't cost you any of your energy. Yeah, that's what I was yeah. thinking. Get a bit low and on energy. I was going to do the shadow assault, which would which won't cost me any energy, and that'll be eight. So that'll be more than enough to kill it. Right, Where's so my um, judgment thing? I can't. Right see. here, judgment. Oops, sorry. Right here. That's judgment, is it? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. See how it says judgment. Oh, sorry. Brutal, brutal assault for you. Oh, brutal assault. Sorry, I was looking oh, at the sorry, wrong one. Yeah, I'm getting confused. 
Right, yeah. brutal assault. I don't know. So that's going to be eight damage, yeah. Eight yep. damage, and and you can see the little health thing right here. You attack their health. Right. Okay. All right, and I am healing. I will be healing what whatever damage comes our way. Right. All right. So let's go ahead and roll for him. Did you write those totals down, Tony? Yep. Oh, he's going to attack. Well, he's going to do piercing. But good, good thing I didn't do block. Five single. One person is going to take five piercing health. If the target is below half health at the end of the round, they gain bleeding. Well, I'm so not taking it. Ambush, <laughs> one target becomes vulnerable. So we can Three choose. It's, it's not done randomly. Ambush. One target becomes vulnerable. It might be random, rough. You're right. One target. No, we're gonna we gotta find out who the target is. This is just a single. So whoever this target is is also gonna become vulnerable. But I don't think it's gonna last. Let's look up vulnerable. Uh, vulnerable does not last. It does stack. Vulnerable targets gain two to their target die result while the combat and suffers one extra damage when damage. You will become vulnerable. That'll be next round. You're not getting out of this He's round. He's not going to so last, is he? No. It's not going to matter. So no. let's go ahead. Everybody roll one die. And whoever rolls the highest is the target. Uh, all right. Hold on. I, I got three. three. Hold on, let me get there, and... Oh, come on. Ten. Yeah, Ruff, you're taking the damage. Thanks. Uh, so, Ruff, hang on just a second. I'm going to... I did Nourish. Um, in combat, one target raises Nourish rank health. So go ahead and take your damage of five. Yep. Now you are going to in combat one target raises nourish rank. That's three. Nourish rank health and gains health regen. Equal to half your shield at rank, but uh, that, which, that, one's, that, which so, one's my nourish? So that's not you, that's me. So go ahead and gain three more health back. All right, okay. One, two, and I healed that turn, so uh, heal. A, so I'm gonna get my second one here. All right, so that's it. That one's done. Tony, would you like to take him into your Dark Legion? Uh, yeah, yeah five, I do. I do. Five, five piercing. Yeah, the piercing is what sold me. And plus your plus your number goes up here to four. Everybody increases. Yep. Right? And then so, I lose three of these points. Uh-huh. Three. And then so... That's, that's the night stalker, right? Yeah, that's the night stalker. Yeah, and his vitals. Oh, when we were doing the damage, you needed to roll for your two, your two. Oh, but your dark legion wasn't out, was it? You did. Nope. You only did the, yep, you're right. Never mind. That's uh, eleven slash eight. Got to remember to get that right. Yep. Now we can do the circumstance. Oh, and also we get four gold and six food. Four gold and six food. Yep. Four gold, six food. Thank you. Your sacrifice was not in vain, Night Stalker. You're going to feed us. <laughs> oh, my Dark Legion's getting up there. 
<laughs> Remember, you can't go over, like you have a food rating down below. You can't go more than that food rating. Oh, so I can't go more than four? Is that what it is? Um, are you a four? Well, yeah, that's what my food rating is. No, 20. You're all the way to the top. Oh. So how many is it? So look, look at the bottom. Look at your food rating below it. Yeah. Food rating is three. three. Oh, four. okay. You can go up to 15. Ah, where the end. Is it five times then? Yes. Yep. All right. So that oh, so how much food was it? Sorry, I forgot. Look, Six. Look, look on that side. Yeah, I didn't want to scroll all the way back there, Tony. Who was going to tell me? All right. I didn't know. <laughs> I'm no very fast with this. Uh, six. All right. All right. Now it is time for us to roll for the circumstance. Six. I'll go ahead. And, we all have to roll. Um, I'll go ahead and roll first. I'm going to use my my hollows here for a circumstance. I get that. I get to. Um, we already. Oh, didn't we already? So, we already did that. Or no? Oh, so, oh, oh! We're on to this part now, right? So we have to do the investigation. Okay, so we need to roll, roll yellow die. Yellow die. Okay. And we must pass our yellow die. One of us must pass our yellow die. We've got no clues or anything on that one, though. I got a nine. We have. Um, yes, we have three Just clues. Three clues. So, so we take. So you oh, fail. It's the trap. It's the trap. You fail, Tony. So we have to do an encounter. Hold on, I haven't rolled mine yet. Hold on. Three. I pass. So I don't even have to roll. So. Um, if, the, if the trap is triggered and any hero critically succeeds, ambush. So I have to do mine too. Mine's a, minus, mine's a minus two. That's a 10. Nope. So we're going to have to face another encounter, but we did get the room. Okay. So that's so, the red room. We have a set now. Did that come day or not? That went night. And we got to do another encounter. So here's our next. Ah. And the encounter says... Um, nobody critically succeeded, so we don't get to ambush it. So here we go. Oh, we get a boon instead. That's a good nice. thing, isn't it? Yep. So uh, draw one. What's that say? One more card? One Can't more read. card, yep. Red hand in the way. Oh, sorry. Draw one more what? Encounter card? Uh, I think. So this is reward table. Choose two options below. Get a two. Choose one option below. I'm not sure how this boon works. Draw yep. one more card. So we're gonna have to. Oh, this. Okay, I remember. We have to draw another encounter, but this is part of the rewards for, for defeating this next encounter. Oh, okay. So you add so that to it. Okay, got it. Side, we're going to grab another encounter, and we're going to go after a level one. <laughs> okay. Oh, die rats. Die rats. This is night, so it is plus two to their outlast. So their outlast is four plus two. Two, and then add two to it because we went at night. That's four plus one per hero, seven. So we're just looking to say, like, can we actually get rid of the outlast this time? Remember how we did it last time? We have to choose one of these. Oh, that's right. Yep. And roll against that stat and do that whole thing. Yep. Well, I'm happy because it's the blue dice, and I have a six on the blue, so. That's good. And critical successes uh, make it go down an additional, I remember, or something. 
So, <clears throat> so remind me, this is different to the other ones. We have to basically outlast the number of turns. So what, what number did we turn seven? So we got to go through seven um, things. But if we get a critical success, it drops it down another one. So Right. So if we each rolled a critical, it would go two, four, six, and one automatically each turn. We can kill it in one turn. Okay, so, or you can do other skills, right? So I'm going to go ahead and roll against it, I think, to start with. You can Try do other it. skills. Where's the skill? My... Oh, I see. That's those three at the top there, yeah? You no, choose so, one. Yes, any, any one of your skills you can roll. And we've got to pass, yeah? Obviously. Yeah, you need to pass to be... Good, and then if you do pass and you call it correctly, you don't have to take his damage, right? Right. I sort of yeah. remember now. Yeah. Okay. Well, I, I passed. He's blue, blue, yellow. So if you don't, you know, if you call like Tony's calling blue, I'm calling blue because it's my highest as well. Oh, excellent. So you two, if he rolls a one through four, you do not have to take his damage. If if we pass or fail, if you pass, if you pass, right? Come on, and I'm gonna do green. I'm gonna have to three, take... no, eight. Shoot, damn, eight. I do not pass. No, I didn't either. So, Tony got one, one, one success. I got one success, yes, and one because it of the automatically one turn, he's down to five. Now let's see what he does to uh, me and Ruff. Well, it could be me if it's a uh, higher. No, no, no. You. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's true. One piercing health. All right. So we right. take a health damage. All right. I'm going to do it again with green. I'm going to try blue again. Blue, I passed. I pass. I pass. Yes. So that's three, four altogether. One, two, three, and one because it's one per turn. And now let's see what he does. So you guys out of one through four won't take anything, but ah. nope, yellow. Become diseased and lose all items with food subtypes. Oh, that sucks. So, oh. so that's <laughs> so that like elderberries. Moon moonshine is a food subtype. Oh, okay, I see where it is. Yep. What about elderberries? Are they a are they a food uh, subtype? Yes, and the blessed rations too. Oh, flipping heck! Oh my God, this is bad. So mysterious. <laughs> I'm going to hear that. Moonshine is food. So get rid of those. Elderberries are gone. Yeah, let's get rid of those. Hold on. My meat pies are gone. Uh, oh, sorry. Out of the way. Uh, uh. What was taken from me? Oh, Where's God. It? Sorry. Sorry. Blue, get out of here. Oh, I'm, I'm off. I'm off. That didn't work. Right. So. <laughs> you trying to take the food off of Mike? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So moonshine gone. Moonshine, elderberries, oh. rations. I got a lot of food on me. Yeah, I did as well. I did too. Luckily, I got ten food. So, but oh, that's rough. Rest rations and healing herbs. No, it's just the blessed rations. Damn rats. And we become diseased? And we become diseased. So I will write that. Will somebody write that on my board for me and I'll read this? Disease. Okay, so this has a lasting effect. It's persistence or disease. Disease heroes who wish to use energy 
must first su uh, succeed on a survival roll in order to rid oh, you're doing it. Okay. the condition. You must heal in a location that provides healing, a village or a monastery. So to get rid of disease, we've got to go to a village or a monastery. If we want to use our energy, we've got to roll against it. Did anybody write for me? Yes, they did. Thank yeah, you. Tony did. Well, that kind of just not very good. That kind of sucks. Hey, right. Nordic, how's it going? One, you work. Uh, <laughs> yeah, right, Nordic, so, uh, get to work. Yeah, why do you work? Uh, conditions disease yes disease. i'm going to roll against my blue this time i'm going to get blue again oh crikey we're still doing it aren't we last yeah. time i passed let's get uh i pass i did not all right so you are gonna have to take his whatever he does this turn and he dies. Three. Those who fail, sir, you two. do two corrosive energy drain. What the heck is that? So two energy. Just two energy, yeah? Two energy. Corrosive. Oh, I need some energy. Oh, my goodness. So corrosive will um, – you cannot heal corrosive. And um, drain means if you were to go below zero – you would have to take from your health. Right, right. All right. He's All right. Dead. We get one gold and three food. Do you want him in your dark legion? No, I can't take him because he's outlast. Okay, he's outlast. One gold and but, three food. But yeah, one gold and three food. Get, Thank you. And then gold. we get this too. Yes. So we got to roll the moon die. I got it. Ten. Ten. Draw one. Can't read it. Random. Familiar. Choose two options below. Oh. We so we have to roll one. twice, yeah? No, no, no. If we would have rolled the hats, we could have chose like three oh, heroes. Okay, right. So it's. But instead, we rolled one random familiar. Here we go. Let's do this. Oops. Not all those. Those go G for group. Grab them, put them in the bag, and pull one out. Oh, all 14 came out. So I'm going to put them back in and see if they come out the same way. It'll be the top one if they don't. They do. Can you shuffle it? Yes, I can. And that's what we hit. The homonoculus? Transmutation. When you gain a power up with a bonus matching this dude, at least one rank must be given to the homunculus. At the, at the beginning of each combat, choose one stat type vital skill or ability until the end of combat, the highest rank of that chosen stat is reduced by half the Nocturus rank and the lowest rank is increased by this rank. Choose the stat if tied. Oh, boy. Okay, who wants this stat? Oh, this I'll, I'll take complicated. <laughs> okay, so first of all, highest stat when game. So when so your highest stat that you have, Tony, is um, the familiar what you're going to start with. It's an eight. It's my shadow assault. Okay, so you're going to be one plus one third of eight. So two. two. That would be so three. three. He's going to start at rank three. Okay. And then you'll have to read and understand what all that means. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck, Tony. 
All right. Well, that could have been a lot better. Yeah. It was a load of nothing, really, wasn't it? And another one comes out here. Oh, treasure. A treasure came out. The Timic figurine. Any hero may suffer one health damage up to once per game turn to activate one of the abilities. Reduce damage an opponent just dealt equal to the current energy, to your current energy. Oh, yeah. Ooh, someone with high energy, that'd be good for them to have. Increase favored opponent damage equal to dealt equal to the current energy. This is all good for energy. Who's got the highest energy? Uh, you do. I'm You're only at, uh, I'm on, well, four, I'm at one, but I can only go up to four. Tony, why don't you take it? You don't have a treasure. Okay. Where's oh, the... no, no. Sorry, you can't take it. We have to get it. We have to go by night okay, roll so... it through, and we find it. Yeah. Okay. Let's knock out one more turn. Then we'll, then I'll have to call it. So, okay. Oh, oh we got to do not this. We're not done yet. Question. Just a question. Yep. Before we do the the that uh, dungeon tiles, they stay out throughout the game, do they? Dungeon, yeah. Yeah, right. I, I reading the rules, I wasn't quite sure. You don't yeah. redraw them every time you go down well, a dungeon. Well, well, we go down right where we left off, and yeah, we continue. Yeah, gotcha. Right, Noctus. All right, oh. so seven more. Oh, dear, oh law. We are at seventy. This is really bad. And we're all diseased. We got to get back to the monastery. Get this disease out. Get healed up, and get and turn in our runes. Eight, a single hero, uh, one critical health damage. Now where were we? We were on here. So we get this. We get this room. Yep. So which, we, which we, are, which we already did. I already added that in there. So. We did okay. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Okay, so eight. Uh, so we uh, one person gets a critical. Yep, yeah, critical health damage. So roll a die. So, so what's it saying? One critical health damage. Yep. Single hero, one critical health. I th I don't think it's random. Uh, I think we could choose who's going to take it. It doesn't say target. All oh, right. Okay. Right. Doesn't say target. Single. Oh yeah. No. Single means one of us. Yeah. We got to roll. Yep. That's Everybody good. roll. High gets it. I got a Ten. seven. Seven. I'm getting it. Oh. Oh dear. And one half, one, one. Okay, that's that's that. Okay, so one turn. Huh? All right, so I think we should head back to the monastery and get. I, I agree with you on that one. Turn in our rooms. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can go reckless and get there. Yeah, let's go for it. What do you think, Ruff? Let's go for it. Yeah, well, when we go reckless, of course, we might, um, but he can't keep up with us, can he? Yep, that's going to hurt him that way. So that's going to yep. be a minus two. And now we've got to roll all three stats. And, oh, uh, no, you've got to choose one of the green, yellow, blue. Can't, can't do both. So I well, will do. I'm going to do the green and the blue. I don't have much. Now. I'm going to do green and blue also. So, reckless. And I'm going to use my Hollis for this one. Hold on, hold on. I've so we were reckless. Each hero suffers two energy drain. Yep. I haven't got two energy. What you go is drain. You go one and one. Oh, health. I see. Oh, right. Okay. 
Yes, it's I, did that my, I did my two energy. Yep, I did two. And we mm. passed navigate, so we're not going to wander. Okay, I roll passed my roll you roll. And I have to eat. Oh, I see. So I've got to roll navigate and or one of the others, right? Yep. The one I don't roll fails, yeah? Yes. So what do I want to do? I don't mind food. Uh, survival. So I won't throw the blue die. So that fouls. You have, you, and you're carrying too much food. You're at 16. You should be at 15. Oh, 15. Sorry. Right. Uh, so I've got to throw the navigate to see if I pass. Uh, and that is – I'm not going to pass that. Am I three? No. Uh, that won't that won't matter. That won't matter. All right. And the explore. See if I get any gold. No, you rotter. You rolled. So I've got to eat three food. Yep. There we go. Done. Okay, so that's it. Nothing good. Went our way that way. No circumstance because we ended up in the monastery. So we go into the monastery and do monastery stuff. Here we go. <laughs> We are going to heals. Oh, right. Yep, the group heals all vitals and and negates any ongoing conditions. So we're no we longer diseased. And vitals includes energy, doesn't it? That's correct. Yeah, so, those yeah. are vitals. Oh, too many. Oop, there we go. And we are going to um, – we have two keys now, which means we can do more gear upgrades. I'm going to cross those off. One, two. So, yeah, that's really good. Uh, and we fly down to three – So we can buy down two. So we have two. So we go all the way down to here. And we can buy gear upgrades, all one, two, three, four levels of gear upgrades. So this one is four. You want to do our runes first? Let's, let's, let's turn in our runes first. Okay. Tony, how many? Um, well, that's the crypt. That's the crypt. Oh, shit. That's right. We don't want to do that. We need to get nope. to a crypt. Yep. But we needed to heal up and stuff. Yeah. Yep. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four to get to the crypt. So this fourth upgrade means we can do four slots. If yes. we had the gold. If we had the gold to do it. If yeah. We right. have the gold. Now, let me do one of them. So that's four. One, two, three, four. So that goes up one. And that goes up. One. Oh, that's still two, isn't it? Let's see. Um, that's two divided by two is still one. No, four divided by two is two, right? That goes up to two. Uh, da, 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 da. let's get this one up as well. All right, I got I did on I've done all my stuff, I got one gold left. Five. Rank six. Hold on. Where it says rank six, relentless strike on mine. I've got little six and a hex. That means if you go down here, or I'm sorry, I keep doing the. If you go down here, it talks about um, at or right there at rank six. Which the, one is got to be at rank six? Well, the relentless strike is rank six. The aggressive strike is rank seven. So. 
this would the for your regret for your aggressive stance at rank seven, this damage is always considered piercing. That which has got to be at rank seven, the red one or the the no the the, the, the aggressive stance. Oh, this so, one here, this yeah, thing here. Yeah. yeah. So right now, all your um all your damage is piercing. Yeah. Gotcha. No matter so what this one, you. this one I've got to I've got to upgrade twice to get yep. to six. That's correct. Yep. All right. Thanks, Tony. Thanks. Thanks, yep. matey. Right. So that's going to be nine. No, that's too much. Let's do one. So that's going to be four. One, two, three, four. Now then, what can we buy? Better get some blessed rations, I think. Sovereign Elixir sure sounds good. Yeah, I got some blessed rations too, Roth. Yeah, because that disease thing erased all our food. <laughs> uh, blessed rations. So let's get three of those times three. So that's three off of that. One, two, three. And I've got four left. Mm. Four, four, four. This item may be used in combat while using the defend action. Mm. No, I'm going to save the rest of my stuff, I think. Yeah. I feel like we're upgrading, but I'm just afraid we're not upgrading fast enough. I know. I think, uh, you know, if we, if, so we play this, if we play this again, we know, especially for my character here, is to upgrade the bugger quick as possible, you know. I think we spent too much time in the um, dungeon. In the dungeon. <laughs> but it was fun. No, that was a blast. I yeah. don't know, though. That gave us a lot of room, so I yeah, don't know. Yeah. We're going to get... Also, oh, it, was, it was also oh. one of those things that it took us a lot. Like, we had to get two of each runes to get one rune, and yeah, you know, we were able to knock out a whole bunch of runes other than that. So, okay. Well, are we done purchasing? Yeah. I am... I just did a... Okay, done. Okay, so it's time for Noctis. Yep. He's up to 77. We do get a minus two. So right now, guys... Okay, so what are we going to knock him down to? That's what I want to know. That's going to be to tell us what gear upgrade that we need to get to. So right now, Tony, tell me how many red rooms that we have to turn in. One. Okay, so that'll put us here. That'll put us at four. How many green rooms to turn in? One. Okay, so that'll put us to here. That'll put us to eight. How many blue rooms? Two. That'll put us to nine. That'll put us to 17. 17. And, um, and 27. 27. So that will get us down to here, tier eight. Twenty-seven will get us down to tier eight. 
which means we have to have you to have your attack rank up to You've got to be, I believe, up to tier eight tier rank on your attack to be able to do damage to it. Okay. Without having to get rid of all this energy first. Right. I believe okay. that's okay. correct. So you need this much more gold. And we also got to find another key because we can only go to seven. Yep. To the so, bottom. Yep. So we got a five minus two. So we got a three. Three, one oh. penalty on all stat plus one penalty on all stats test next game turn. So that's all right, so everybody put your white die back on your stats and put it on a one. Okay. All right. Okay. I think that's uh, the turn. Yep. Oh. How many turns do we have left? Not very many. Uh, three, four, max. So, yeah, three full turns, four turns, three, three would get us to uh, 98. Okay, yeah, four turns left. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Yeah, four turns. We got to get to, okay, so we got to get to the, so this is what could happen. We could we could go to the crypt to turn in our runes. Worst case scenario, we wander, we waste one turn wandering, and then get to the crypt. That'll leave us two turns after that. We could take on some bosses, could hurt our you know our stats and stuff, mm -hmm. but it gives more gear upgrades and things. Yep. We We're gotta get to the crypt. We gotta get to that crypt. We got to. So all right. Let's uh I'm gonna go ahead and get out. I saved it for my side, so we're good to go there. Oh And with that, guys, I'm gonna Ooh. say that was that was a little intense, and it's gonna get uh, quite a bit more intense uh, <laughs> with only like three turns, and we're gonna have to we might have to do some quite a bit of reckless running right now. I was I was thinking that, yeah, but that means we're gonna wander more easily, or not? Yeah, I mean, there's a chance of wandering. I mean, my wander is not too bad because I do have this this Hollis that helps me. So yeah. seven, seven or less for me, and we don't wander. That that I mean, helps. Yeah, we only need one success, don't we? So. Yep. Yeah, uh, if we were down here and we could take on, you know, this three. Oh, I've lost the, the thing. I've gone out of that now. So hold on, let me get it back. If we would have, if we could have taken on the three collectors and knocked him down three a turn. That would have that would have helped us. Because you find them, you got to fight. So it's kind of an interesting mechanic, right? Because you want to just face one at a time. You're only going to have to fight one, but you're only getting the benefit of one. Where you go to a three, if you defeat them, you're going to knock them down in one turn, three blood collection. But it's more dangerous, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I get what you're saying on that. Yeah. It's an interesting trade off there. I was kind of avoiding those, but maybe. Maybe we gotta, you know, in future games, we gotta take a chance and really go for that. Yeah, it's just suck that we couldn't find them. Like we tried twice, and so yeah. Hello. Yeah. So, all we right. Well, I'm looking at gear upgrades and stuff. Sometimes yeah, we, we get a lot of them in these power ups, which we might get when we turn in some runes. We might get some gear upgrades. Yeah, that's true. That might help us find, be able to find them if we can get that. So I agree. And as I say, playing it again, I will play that differently now. So, um, you know, it's weird. Well, I play it? with most games. You play it once, you're like, oh, yeah. you're trying it out. By the time you play nah. it again, you're like, ah, okay, I know how to do I've this. I've got to get gear ups, gear upgrades, yep. quick. Yep. Yeah. So, 
So um, I will we'll let you know what's going on. Um, I start up professional development on Tuesday, but I probably will want to play because it's going to be mind boringly boring. Possibly, hopefully not. Hopefully, it's a good training, but we'll see what happens. So I'll there's, let you guys know. Always boring bits in any course you do. Yeah, that's true. That's you true. Just so. get I do another day too. I'm open all next week, so just let me know what works. Okay. Yep. We'll uh, we'll 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 get together and then. Uh, it may be not a war game Wednesday, but this time on Wednesday, or not a nor, no war game men's Wednesday on Thursday instead yeah. of Wednesday. Not a war game on Tuesday, except on Wednesday. Except yeah, on Wednesday. Wednesday. Because I can't go backwards. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right. Whenever, whenever's good, maybe. Whenever's good. All right, guys. Um, All I got to get going, so I will see everybody later. Uh, thanks for everybody joining, and cool. we'll see you uh, on the flip side. Bye, everybody.